I'm Amy from Body Fit by Amy, and this is your beach body weight workout. It's summer, we all want to look and feel our best and get outside. So this workout is going to get you that beach body we all want, and it's using no equipment, just body weight moves, so you can actually do it on the beach. All you need is a towel or a mat. Let's do it. Okay, so we're just gonna start by marching, roll through those shoulders. We're just gonna get a quick little warm up, and during the warm up, I'm gonna tell you how we're gonna do this workout. So deep breath in and out, and let's just reach across. So within this workout, we're gonna do three circuits of four exercises. Those four exercises are gonna be cardio, lower body, upper body, and core. Reach it over. Each circuit we're gonna go through twice, the first time, we're gonna go 50 seconds work and then 10 seconds rest. Let's go hamstrings, bring them up. And then the second time is our lightning round. We're gonna cut it in half, 25 seconds work, five seconds rest, okay? So, by all means, go at your own pace. If you need to go a little bit slower, hit pause, totally fine. And it doesn't matter how quick you're doing the exercises during the workout, one more time, reach it over. All that it matters is that you're working. So try to work through that whole time, even if you're going a little bit slower. Don't worry, next time you'll be faster. Okay, so here we go. We're gonna go into our very first circuit and our first cardio move is gonna be called the jackknife kick. So you know that jackknife uh, dive we do off the diving board? Let's kick it forward. So we're straight up. Join me when you're ready. We're going 50 seconds. So the important thing with this, it's kind of like that little warm up we do, those toy soldier kicks, but we want those hands up and we're crunching over. So if you notice, my whole body's coming forward, not just my arms. So that's keeping my arms nice and tight. So even though this is our cardio block, we're getting arms and we're also whoo, getting a standing crunch working the abs. So I know you might be thinking, doesn't feel too much like cardio, but don't worry, it will. And our next move, our next leg move, is a little bit higher intensity, so that's why we're starting with this. So, go at your own pace. We only have about five more seconds. Jackknife kicks, four, three, two, good. So tap it out, you have 10 seconds. Tap or jog it out. Our next move, our leg move, we're gonna go surfer squat. So watch me, we're here, jump it over. So you're surfing, ride the wave. Low impact, just tap it in. Still get that squat, low as you can go, switching sides. Here we go, surf, ride the wave, breathe. So, you're gonna have to get used to my cheesy beach exercises. Everything has somewhat of a beachy summery name, but that's fun, right? Whew. Here we go, I told you this would be cardio. Remember, you can always take it down to that lower impact version of the move. We have 10 seconds to go. Here we go. Get low in that squat. Get that butt down. And four, three, two, good. Breathe, 10 seconds. Whew. Let's take it down to your mat. Okay, so we're down here, push up position, and we're gonna bring the elbow up. So watch me. We're gonna call it push up, shark, Push up, shark. So you're just bringing that elbow right up by your side, nice and tight, make that sharp fin. If you need a modification, down on the knees. Here we go, push up, shark, push up, shark. Up to you, and again, doesn't matter how fast you're going, as long as you're doing the work during that 50 seconds, squeeze in the back. So really imagine that you have dumbbells, guys, and you're pulling up like a row. So nice and tight in the back. And again, it's totally fine to do a modified version. Squeeze. Make sure you just have good range of motion. Use your abs. Squeeze in the back. One more. And breathe. Good, guys. Stay on the mat. Let's flip it over. 10 seconds goes fast, right? So boat V up. So that nice good boat pose, either here or out. We're going to extend it out. Pull it in. Extend it out as low as you can go. Pull it in kind of like a V up. If you need a modification, you can have those hands here. Out and in. We're going, here we go. Breathe. 
out, boat, bring it in, squeeze, and around. So sort of a cross between that boat pose and that V up, and breathe. Really touch that lower back to the floor, maybe all the way up to the shoulder blades if you can. Reach it around, breathe. Whew, 10 seconds. This is where we catch our breath because we're gonna go right back to that cardio. Remember, it's our lightning round. Only 25 seconds. One more. Good. Bring it back up for those jackknife kicks. We got five seconds. Here we go, guys. 25 seconds. Bring it in. Crunch. Crunch. Like you're diving into the ocean. Get those feet up. You know my legs are a little bit tired after those squats. We're gonna make sure the whole body's working. Pull it in. Crunch in the abs. Straight arms, nice and tight. Breathe. We got five seconds. Whoo. And relax for five seconds. Surfer squats. Ready? Here we go. Only 25 seconds. Ride the wave. Get low. Lots of legs. Push into the heels. Use your abs. You got it, guys. We're over halfway there. Please go fast. Make sure you're getting low. Breathe. Five, four, three, two, and one. Good. Five seconds. Push up, shark. Ready. Here we go. Push up, shark. Push up. Whew. Modify if you need to, but good form. If you're modified, I want you to get lower. Here we go, guys and breathe. Almost there, five seconds. You got time for a couple more. Breathe and relax. Flip it over, boat pose, V up, breathe. Here we go. This lightning round is fast, but we're gonna get a full minute rest after this. So breathe and in that rest, I want it to be an active rest, keeping moving. And I'll explain our next round. <sighs> Around, remember you can always modify with a little bit of balance. Four, three, two, relax. You did it guys, tap it out. Whew. So that was our first circuit, that's how it's gonna go. Moves fast, keeps that heart rate up. So active rest for a minute, tap it out, jog it out, whatever you wanna do, keep your heart rate up. We'll show you our next four moves. First one, our cardio. Burpee, we love it, except we're gonna do a burpee with swimming. So all the way down, jumping in the ocean, swimming, four, three, two, one, push it up, jump it up. That's move number one. Number two, we all like to go running on the beach. Lunge, run, power it up. I'm gonna give you a couple modifications between that, so don't worry. Number three, it's gonna be our crab dip. Remember those crab walks from when we were kids? We're gonna dip and then kick. And last one is gonna be backstroke. Whew, we got five seconds. Get ready, guys. Burpee swimming, here we go. Take it in the burpee, all the way down. Four, three, two, push it up, jump it up. I want good form, here we go. All the way down, four, three, two, Push it up, jump it up. You need to modify, walk it out, drop it down. Four, three, two, and then bring it up, walk it in. Good form, here we go guys, halfway there. 25 seconds, and bring it up. It's kinda nice, cause it's like you get a little break and work our backs. And bring it up, lots of cardio. Four, three, two, good. Bring it up. One more, you got 10, four, four, three, two, whoo, and bring. Good guys, let's stay down here. Crab walk, I think this is what we called it when we were kids. So up in that bridge tabletop, bend in the elbows, kick it up. Join me when you're ready. So you see my fingertips are pointed in. This feels like too much. You can just do it here, just do a little bend in the elbows. Still feels like too much, 
just take it back to here, guys, and just do the arms. But if we can, we're gonna keep those hips up, add a little kick, and that's gonna get our glutes and hamstrings. As you can tell, even though we're splitting it up, I still like to work a lot of muscles at once. And like everything on this channel, everything I do as a trainer, my goal is to keep your heart rate up the whole time, 10 seconds. I'm getting tired, I'm gonna find my balance in good form again. And kick, one more. Good, relax, breathe. Whew, shake that out. Backstroke, guys, so all the way down as if you're going back. So it's up to you. You can take it if you need to go halfway down on your head and just do the little flutter kick or just the upper. That's fine too. If you can, lift those shoulders, keep it low, really reach for it. Backstroke, abs in tight, breathe. Good, neutral spine with that head, tuck that chin, making sure that we're not reaching up or letting it drop. Whew. This is long for this, I know. If you need a little stretch break, take it, come right back into it. Backstroke through the ocean, 10 seconds. Whew. Lower abs, upper abs, four, three, two, relax. Bring it up, guys. Huh, we forgot our lunge run. <laughs> we gotta add it in. We're not done. Right foot forward, left foot back, run it up. So lunge, bring it up. Lunge, bring it up. Join me when you're ready. We're actually gonna do 50 seconds each leg. So this circuit actually has five. If you want, add a little jump. Little jump. And if you want even more, sprint it down. So you really get those glutes. Feels like too much? Keep it small. Totally fine. You can even keep it off the ground and just tap it in. Or if you need extra balance, hold the wall or back of the chair. If you can, runner's lunge, low, high. Whew. So if you can get low with it, guys, you're gonna really feel that burn in the leg. 10 seconds, Whew. there we go. Four, three, two, and one. Ha, good, breathe. Let's go other leg, you know that heart rate's up. Left leg forward, right leg back, powered up. So start small, lunge, run, lunge, run. Then you have all these different options. You can power it up with a jump, you can get low, power it up, or you can get low without the jump. Totally fine, or keep it small, or balance. Whew. Halfway there. You can do it guys, here we go. Work the legs as low as you can go to really get those glutes and hamstrings firing. Whew. Really activating. Ha! Oh, 50 seconds is a long time. Make sure you're not sacrificing form. Power. If you feel like you are, just take it a little slower, guys. Totally fine, that's where we're going for time. Breathe. Whew. Now we made it through that circuit, that's a long one, because we got two legs. Back to those burpees. Ha! Ah, heart rate's up. 25 seconds, you can do it. Burpee, swim, four, three, two, bring it up, jump it up, here we go. We're only gonna have time for a couple. Bring it up, I think we got two more. Bring it down, swim, and bring it up. And bring it up and breathe. All right, let's keep the order. We'll go back to that crab dip. Here we go, guys. Whew. Down, kick. Five seconds is a really short amount of time. Whew. Breathe. You got this, guys. Bend in the elbows, drop in the hips. Kick it up together, five seconds. Push out of those tries and relax. Whew. Let's go backstroke and here we go. Opposite arm and leg. This is basically the opposite of the swimming from burpee. Front stroke, front stroke is that thing? Whew. Freestyle and backstroke. Keep those shoulders lifted. 
Keep everything pulled in, pull that belly button towards the mat. Make sure that you're not arching that back five seconds. Breathe, guys. All we got after this are those lunges. And relax, bring it up. All right, you can do it right foot forward. Power, lunge run, running on the beach. Power it up, low impact if you want. Touch it down if you can. Breathe, up, almost there. Power, five seconds, four, three, two, good, tap it out. Other side, here we go, here, bring it up. Heart rate staying up, low if you want to. Breathe, Whew. so close guys. Keep it low and pat, we'll really get low. Breathe, five seconds, four, three, two, and one. Ah, tap it out. All right guys, we got a minute. When you catch your breath, get a sip of water. I'm gonna talk you through this. First one, cardio. Hot sand. So we're going one, two, three, one, two, three. You know how it is when you're on the sand and your feet are hot. You gotta keep them moving. Next one, cannonball squat. Sit low, goblet squat like we would do. Grab like a cannonball. Power it up. You can jump it or up on the toes. That cannonball needs to do into the pool. Whew. Bring it right down. Rest stroke, tricep push up. So watch me. We're gonna go out and around, like a breaststroke, arms by your side, push it up, then lower it down. Out and around, squeeze in the back, push it up, lower it down, okay? Last move will be our starfish. I'm gonna take an extra 30 seconds on this. So make sure you're still moving, keep my heart rate up. Nice and wide, reach up, starfish pose like a star, opposite hand to opposite foot. All right, are you moving? 20 seconds, tap it out, jog it out. Get ready, it's our last round. We got four moves for 50 seconds, four moves for 25. We can do it in 10 seconds. Woo! We needed that extra 30. Whew. Here we go, hot sand, get on the beach. I was on the beach earlier today, this is how it felt. Here we go, one, two, three, one, two, three. Whew. Gotta keep those feet moving really quick. So even if you're low impact, you're moving them fast. Bring them up. Knee up high. We've done this in a football workout. It's called the Heisman. You can do it. And really land low. Push out of that outer thigh. Good guys. Halfway there. I'm going to give you another option. Really low into that hip. So it's like you're landing in a squat, or you can keep one, two, three, one, two, three. Cardio is what we want. We want to work those hips, outer thighs, glutes, quads, and hamstrings. Five seconds. Who remembers what's next? Cannonball squat. Whew. Here we go. Goblet squat. Breathe. Drop it down. Cannonball. Power up on your toes or drop it down, power up in the jump, up to you, and up, and up. So I'm landing low and soft, and then up on the toes, I'm curving around. So basically the cannonball is just making you get down there. Even when I say goblet squat, I know some of us like to be here. Let's go here, bring it up, heels down, push through those heels, halfway there guys. Get that butt as low as you can go. Cannonball, jump in, jump out. Whew. I know, this is our last circuit. Breathe, 10 seconds. Cannonball, jump out. And breathe, one more. Whew. Tap it out, 10 seconds, guys. Rest stroke, tricep push up. Start all the way down, out with me. Here we go. Around, arms and legs, hands in, push it up. Lower it down. Out and around, breast stroke. Push up. Lower down. Elbows stay in the whole time, right by your body. Push it up. 
Use your abs. Breathe. So even if you have a back to sit, guys, when you kind of pull a little bit first and then push up, totally fine. This move is a great way to get strong in that tricep push up. That one's really hard. You can tell right here, we're getting both sides of it, but without multiple reps, we're getting a little break with the breaststroke. 10 seconds. Hands out, squeeze in the back. Hands by your side, push it up, use your abs. Lower down, use your abs. One more. Out, squeeze, push it up, and breathe. Last one, guys. Starfish. And we got our leg around, and that's it. So nice and wide, make a star. Reach it up. So I'm staying a little bit higher because my mic pack, but you can go all the way down, all the way up. Even if you just make it small, you really pull it the ass. If you can, reach it up, opposite hand to opposite foot. Lower, nice and slow. I don't want to see you drop. Control it with the abs the whole time. Arms and legs stay wide. Reach, stretch, abs. Stretch, breathe. Woo. You can do it, guys. Breathe up and then ten seconds. Reach, take it back. So again, I'm staying a little higher because of the mic pack on my back. You can go a little lower. One more. Relax. Stretch it out. All right, guys. Lightning round. You got this. It's going fast. Twenty-five seconds. All we need, hot sand starting now. One, two, three. One, two, three. Get really low, even lower than you were before. Half the time. You can do it. Breathe. Ten seconds if you want. Bring the knee up. Sit low in the leg. Four, three, two, three. Good, guys. Cannonball squat, ready. Here we go, goblet squat, get low, power up. Get low, power. Whew. Breathe, it's gonna go by fast. Keep those heels down, get that butt low. Drop in the hips, not in the chest. Breathe, almost there. Five seconds. I know I'm tired too, keep that chest up, don't round in the back. One more, and breathe. Tap it up, guys. Breaststroke, tricep push up. You can do it. Starting out, here we go. Out and around, squeeze, push it up. Lower down. Out and around, squeeze, push up. Elbows in tight. Breathe. You got this, guys. And down. And breathe. Five seconds. I think we got time for one more. Take it around, squeeze, push. And breathe. All right, guys. Starfish. We got this. Here we go. Nice and wide. Opposite hand. And breathe. And out. We are so close finishing this workout. It's about 20 minutes all together. Heart rate's up the whole time. Breathe. Five seconds to go. Reach. Back. Whew. One more. And relax. Ha. Stay here, guys. Breathe. Knees up to the side. Either cross or in front. Catch your breath. Lower it down. Whew. We did it, guys. Hopefully your heart is pumping like mine. Bring them in. Reach it over. So, as you can tell, that moves fast. Heart rate's up the whole time. We're covering all the muscle groups. With those circuits, cardio, lower, upper, core, the lots of things are working within those. So almost all of them are full body exercises. Bring it to the back, thumbs back, open up that chest. So if you need more, feel free to catch your breath, get a sip of water, go through all that again. Or write them down, take them to the beach. You can do this on the beach, guys. People will be impressed. Turn it in, child's pose, big reach, head down, Reach those fingertips away, sit those hips to the back. Thank you for putting up with my cheesy exercise names. I hope you have fun. Big deep breath in. As always, breathe out. 
Get more of a stretch on your own. And you did it, guys. That was your beach body weight workout. Great job, everybody.